Good morning. Um, so I thought I would make this walk and talk video. So the plan was that I'd do it later, but I just worked out and now I'm walking back because I'm like, I don't want to run. So I'm like, I have time. So why not do the walk and talk now? Probably not a good idea because I don't know if I have the energy to do it. So yeah, I started working out every day, which is crazy, right? Um, well, yesterday it wasn't because like we had this thing and like we had to get up early and we wouldn't have done it, finished it. Um, so yeah, that's new. Working out every single morning, almost, uh, which is good. I'm still getting used to it to like have energy because I'm like, yeah, that's great to work out. But then also like I want to kind of take a nap right after that. Anyway, today I wanted to talk about the difference between a cool story and a true story. And I got the idea to talk about that. So that is something that has like been on my mind for a long time. But just recently I recorded a, a podcast with one of my friends and the topic was personal branding. And one of the questions he asked me was, Finn, how can you always be 100% real on Instagram, on YouTube, on the internet? And my first answer is, I'm not 100% real at all. Like, I don't think that, I, that would be incredible if that's possible. Like, I'm trying to be as real as possible. I'm trying to be as much me as possible, but I'm definitely not 100%. But so his question, question was more like, how are you comfortable like sharing the good and the bad, the successes and the failures? How are you comfortable being weird, goofy and making fun of yourself? And I realized the reason for me why that is not really that hard is because I know why I share my journey. And I, I started my Instagram, I started my YouTube channel because I wanted to document my journey and hopefully maybe help some people or inspire some people along the way. And so for me, it was never was like, oh, I'm building and this and then I can make money off of YouTube or I can like monetize my Instagram audience or I can do this to like find a job or like that, that was not, not never the reason why I wanted to do it. And I realized the only way to help people and to inspire people is by telling a true story. Everyone wants to tell a cool story, right? Because like, it's a cool story. Like everyone wants to tell a cool story and you tell a cool story by omitting all the bad parts, like over exaggerating all the good parts. That's when you have a good story. But only, only the problem with the cool story is that people see that it's a story and just a story cannot inspire action. So for example, if you watch a video or a movie, right? And you watch the movie, you know, it's a good movie. You're like, oh my God, that was a great movie. Like amazing characters, amazing story. And then at the end of the movie, there's this one sentence and it says based on a true story. And that one sentence somehow changes the whole thing, right? Because like now suddenly all the things you just watched and this amazing story and this amazing character, this hero, suddenly realize fuck this is not a story that someone came up with in their mind this is not fiction this is real and the thing with real means that it's replicable that people can do it again because if someone has done it once it's possible again right and so that's why for me i want to show all of it good and bad. I want to be me as much as possible. So show the weird and stuff because only that way I can tell a true story. A true story is showing everything. And because only a true story can inspire action because only a true story makes people realize, wait, this is actually possible because it actually happened. And if it's actually happened, then I can do it too. So that was kind of a long answer. I'm not sure if I'm gonna record this again because like, as I said, I just came back from the gym. This is how I look. And that's about it. I hope you guys 
Have a beautiful Sunday, and I see you guys next Sunday. Hard to wake up when there's no alarm to wake you up. See